that's 133. Oh, fits in nice. Perfect. All right, let's do it. Let's go to Big Bear. <laughs> There's loads of cabins, but it's all spaced out. It's great and everything from the storage underneath. We can have our bags, they're nice and tucked away. We have a sofa. And over here, we've got the bed. Nice place to wake up to. And you know, we can make our breakfast in the kitchen, which is nice and compact. We have all the utensils, we got knives, we got a little hob, a little sink, everything you need. And we brought so much food, we did. which goes perfectly in the fridge. As you can see, there's no room. No room. We've jam packed it. And once we have this, we'll eat all our food. And after that, you might need the toilet, which again, it's nice and compact. It's very comfortable. And you've got your own little nook here. You might feel a bit dirty after the toilet. So maybe you want to pop in the shower. Mm -hmm. And of course, you guessed it. They thought of everything. You've got shampoo, conditioner, body wash. And once you're all freshened up, you're ready to go outside. And this is where you can really smell the woods. We've got a little bench here, and we also have our private barbecue area. Lovely little fire pit. We've got some wood underneath the camera. We've got lovely benches, better company, and we're going to sit back and relax and just enjoy this trip. All right, so Ben is currently outside on a little walk, getting some B-roll shots, enjoying the nature. So I thought that I would do my skincare right now because we are out in the nature and I should probably go all natural. I brought all my skincare in this little pouch. And of course, I'm gonna start off with a cleansing balm. This is Belief's Aqua Balm Makeup Removing Cleansing Balm. You guys know how much I love using cleansing balms as the first step of my skincare routine. This is how I remove all my makeup. It's gentle, it's efficient. So as you can see, it starts off pretty waxy. I'll get like that amount. And as you can see, it's like in a solid form. So I'll start rubbing it on my hands. The heat on my fingers are making it into an oil. And then I just put it right on my skin, like such. And it just melts off all my makeup, my foundation, my brows and it's removing all my makeup while still being really gentle on my skin's moisture barrier. This cleansing balm actually has the same benefits as the aqua balm, which I also brought. And it looks like it's uh, melted off all my makeup. So I'm gonna rinse off and I'll be right back. So I went ahead and did the rest of my skincare routine, but now we are going to finish it off with a moisturizer. This is Belief's Aqua Balm, and this is just going to lock in the hydration. This is actually my second jar of this. I love this stuff. It's a favorite of mine because it's just a lightweight gel cream that revives my dull skin. This is great for all skin types, whether you're normal, dry, oily combination, they got you. This cream especially targets dry skin, uneven texture, and dullness. This has ceramide 3, which helps retain water, and it has glycerin, which helps the skin's moisture. If I had to make a metaphor, Aqua Balm is like drinking a tall glass of iced water on a scorching day. My choice for moisturizer is always Aqua Balm. And voila, my skin is finished and I'm ready to just chill out. If you guys are interested in any of Belief's products, you can go on Sephora.com and go in Sephora in stores. I'll also leave a link to all the products in the description box. So definitely. Go check that out. Fire is going, we have a lift off. For tonight's din din, we're making veggie skewers. So we've got two bell peppers and some mushrooms. And I'm just gonna wash these, prep them, and get them all ready. Ah, look at that! Wow, Christmas. I like it. Oh, yours is prettier than mine. Oh, what's yours? Oh, I just went green. What if we made sandwiches out of this? With the we bread? Could. We could. What do you think? Is this just an excuse to have bread? Yeah. <laughs> she is enjoying the view. <laughs> we might be doing it slightly wrong, but it's still gonna cook, isn't it? Yeah. Fun fact, did you know that the tip of the fire is the hottest? You know when they used to like roast people on fire for like 
being a witch. Yeah. As the face gets closer to the tip of the fire, that's where it starts to burn. Actually, I'm not completely sure about this fact. I'm sure someone in the comments will let me know if it's true or not. And don't try and burn someone. We have to say that these days, don't we? Health and safety part. Health and safety. Which is always important. Anyone watching at home, health and safety is very important. Those are burning. See, it makes me doubt your uh, your methodology. Yeah, there. I know, right? It's actually the hottest part of the flame is probably just where the fire just, starts. Just ignore anything we've said for the last <laughs> 10 minutes. Who needs a toaster? You know? Again, I probably burned the bread and realized that we need a toaster. <laughs> that lovely toast. Perfect. Wow, it is. Wow, look at that toast. It's perfect. Mm. Guys, Ben made his famous potato salad as a side. Every time. Why is your potato salad so good? It's made with love. Get this. Cream cheese. This is a vegan cream cheese. It's by the brand Mykonos. It is absolutely delicious. I'm creating a barbecue sandwich. So I've got a layer of the Mykonos cream cheese and I'm gonna add some bell pepper. And then I'm gonna get a little bit of mustard. This is Coleman's. It's a bit spicy. English. <laughs> no. Oh no. Oh, oh no. no. Oh no! I'm just showing off about the new mustard. I'm sorry, babe. It's okay. Honestly, I'm glad it's getting on the sweater and not on something else. That's just hot. Smudge it in. Yeah, we're perfect. Good as new. It <laughs> so as we said, Commons mustard, delicious. <laughs> Are you really putting everything in there? Yeah. Wow. All right. So this is what it looks like. I'm gonna doubt spice it up. Mmm. Okay, so it is 8.30. We're about to play a riveting game of Taboo. Taboo. The way you play Taboo is there is a word and we have to describe the word without using certain keywords. Okay. Well, For example, motorcycle is the word. Uh -huh. So you can't say leather, helmet, bike, ride, Harley Davidson. So if I'm saying, oh, you you ride your... <laughs> Oh, I said right. Uh, yeah, fail. so you can't do it. So you gotta I'm do next already. one. Yeah, you have exactly. a failure. All right, I'm a failure. I'm not you gonna pay this anymore. Contenders ready, set, go. All right, this is what you use. It's a it's a paper, and you use it for directions. Map. Yes. All right. It's uh it's cold, and there's a lot of Icicles. it. Icicles. No, uh, it's a. Snow. There's so much of what you said. Snow, yes, so it's icicles. A, uh, ice, yeah, there's, uh, yeah, there's um, all that stuff. Rain. Like it's a gaming program. A gaming program? Yeah. Well, this is a left okay, field. Okay, okay, okay. We built this... City on rocket roll. No, no, one word. City. There we are. The pointy things that have been there for years and no one can figure out um, how they were built. The, one of the biggest... Uh, Mysteries or something that are in in um place where they've got Stone lots of age. sand and stuff. Almost, but it's pyramids. Like, yeah, done. Um, oh, my name and the opposite of small. Ben. Benjamin. Opposite of small. Ben G. Opposite of small. <laughs> What's the opposite of small? Small. The opposite of small. Big. In in. Biggie. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what was that? Big Ben. <laughs> My name and the opposite of small. Small. <laughs> Big, biggie. Get it together. Right, it's together. Get it together, it May. Together. Andy Warhol was this. An artist. Yes. All right. Uh, oh, I'm your biggest fan. Yes. Yeah. Uh, all is. right. Let Netflix and. Chill. Yep. Yeah. Right. Oh, this is a. Oh, this is Cuddles. so nice. Cuddles. Cuddles. Um, oh, and my favorite uh, one is the LFC one. Or oh, your favorite one is mug. Yeah. LFC cup mug. No, next. Ch coffee. Nope. Mug. What uh, else? Sippy cup. Nope. Uh, it's so. Mm, it feels good. Oh, blanket. Yeah. yeah. All right. I put this on everything in the morning when I'm when I'm cooking. Butter. No, it's olive like, oil. It, yep. Yeah. Oil. No. Olive. Whiffle, Whiffle ball. What the fuck is that? Oh, no.
loving it. Kama Sutra, does it suit you? Your velvet dress is slipping off. Would you stay with Make me? Make the potatoes! It's coming through you, never knew you, never knew how much it means. When you spoke to me, but everyone needs something. Mm, so good. Mm -hmm. I know that I'm All right, guys, it is one o'clock. We are slowly getting back up again. We just took a little 15 minute nap. We're just really lounging about. Ben's looking at the binoculars. On the lookout. I was really surprised that Chiki was able to keep up with us. I thought she was going to want to give up midway, but she was hyped. She did good. She did really good. I didn't tell you guys this, but I made a very, very extensive, thorough itinerary of this trip. This is what I did last Friday night. This is what I like to do on my free time now. Like, look, I even wrote like the, the weather, the highs, the lows. It's a 20 minute drive to Lake Gregory. Yeah, I'm just gonna do some light makeup, nothing too crazy. All my makeup is in this bag. This is where my makeup brushes are, and then this is where my makeup's at. We whipped up a tomato veggie sauce with chickpea pasta. That's, that's starting to disintegrate, but it's okay. Well, chickpea pasta is a bit healthier. It is. But this this place is amazing. You just really don't you don't need much, you know. You can live off such small quantities. It's great. Mhm. Mm like this little cabin has everything we need. Yeah. I think even I think this year in general, I think it's kind of taught a lot of people that you know we simplify and it's quality, not quantity, and it's kind of what really matters, and you know mm. appreciate the small things more. So after this, we're gonna watch a movie, mm -hmm. and James, Jen's brother, our brother, he's given us three movies, and he's changed the names so we don't know what they are. Mm -hmm. So it's like a surprise. Yeah, so, uh, it's uh, it's gonna be exciting because a lot of times when we have like Netflix or Hulu, we just get bombarded by all the options and we end up just not watching anything. Mm -hmm. So we thought it would be better for James to just pre-select some movies, remove the name, mm -hmm. and we just go in blank. Yeah, again, it's simplifying it, you know? We have no choice. It's mm -hmm. like when you, know, when you used to go on an airplane back in the day and there was mm -hmm. one movie that was playing, you gotta watch it. Exactly. Um, and, but James knows our taste as well. That's we, true. You know it's going to be. No pressure on James, but it's going to be good, so. Oh, I feel so refreshed. Oh. So 
where we spy on people. Wildlife. Wildlife. Bird watching. <laughs> you know, everything's really spaced out here. You can't, it's hard to spy. But right now it's sunset and everyone's out. Oh my gosh, I think he sees me with my binoculars. <laughs> <laughs> These binoculars are amazing. I know. Oh my gosh, wait, I see a bird. The people are watching me with my binoculars. It's not that weird. It is weird. If is you look it? over and you see people with binoculars that look like they're looking <laughs> your way, that's weird as hell. That's true. There's a big window this here. Is the place for binoculars. This is the place for binoculars. This is the exact place for binoculars. <laughs> All right. Is it time? It's time it's for movie movies. time. I told him not to put in any scary films. Oh my gosh, watch, it's like Cabin, Cabin in the, the Woods. woods. <laughs> oh my god, kill me. Alright, okay, so there's three options. One is BBB. -B -B. The second one is Flanders. And the third one is River. Oh. He suggested that we watch River. River. Yeah. You guys ready? Alright, here we go. Is it supposed to be like this? Oh. Okay, it's just the style. Oh. Wow. I don't like it, it's already scary. Oh, I know what this is. Like friend, all... friend online, or like search online, searching. Friend... No, it's not searching, but it's like searching, where it's all on the computer interface. Wow. That's intense. <sighs> it was really intense. I was just on the edge of the bed the entire time. It was a th thriller. Like a cyber internet thriller. No. It was very disturbing. It's basically about hackers in the deep web that enjoy a lot of weird fucked up things. I, I want to cover that little webcam thing yeah. on my laptop. I like the concept of it. I like, I like how it's different. It's very unique and it, I was gripped. The hint James gave us was basically the river you go down through the dark the web. web. I want, is that what it looks like? Or is that just... I, know, I think I think parts of it. They say, I've never been on the dark web, but no, me neither. Um, from an article I read on the New Yorker, they said that when you go into the deep web, it's it, the interface is really complicated. Like, you, you don't know where to start. Cheek is unsure. She's just excited about this movie. She's like, oh, this is... So that was a Korean movie with no subtitles. So... We're gonna go with BBB. We're gonna go BBB. Click. Click. Wait. Oh yeah. Oh, I like okay. this movie. I like this movie. We made two types of toast. We've got banana and blueberry. So we got creative, didn't we? Yeah, we really did. You just put, pop the bread on a frying pan and you're good. Mmm. Cream cheese is amazing. Mm -hmm. So good. A bit of salt, pepper, mm -hmm. fresh tomatoes. Mm. That's all you need. Let's go, come on. 